ago. My name is Chris. I'm a uh, chassis leader in the Michigan State Formula Racing Team. Uh, Formula SAE is part of the Collegiate Design Series. It's one of the largest in the world. And it challenges students every year to design, build, test, and compete with a small open wheel race car. So here we have the SR18. This was a complete redesign of the platform. Uh, by redesign, what we did was we redesigned the primary structure, which is a carbon fiber and aluminum honeycomb monocoque. Uh, we stuck with the same tires and the same motor, but changed uh, suspension parameters, powertrain parameters. Um, uh, there are several competitions here in the United States. There's one in uh, Lincoln, Nebraska at the airport. Uh, the biggest in the world is here at uh, Michigan International Speedway. And over 120 teams compete there, including teams from uh, Germany, Austria, China, Japan, all over the world. Um, this really allows us to apply our classroom principles that we learned through our studying our engineering degrees into real world applications where we can grow as a team, uh, solve problems, and gain some real world experience where we can actually communicate with some of these sponsors mm -hmm. uh, and gain things like internships and full-time positions. Uh, yeah, it's a really great opportunity to go fast and have a lot of fun. Now, if you're uh, looking into going to college, say you're in high school and you have a passion for racing, is this something you could get involved with if you went to Michigan State, or what's the process to join the team? Yeah, so we take uh, anyone, any major, anyone who wants to join who's just uh, interested in working hard and building a, a fast car. Um, and there's opportunities for anyone. I, I myself am a mechanical engineer, but we have uh, electrical engineers, we have uh, business majors, uh, people who can, you know, obviously communicate with sponsors for us, kind of interface uh, between um, the sponsors and the engineering department, things of that nature. So it's really just dependent on if you're willing to make the time commitment and if you're interested in, uh, in uh, winning <laughs> fast. <laughs> is this a program that uh, you get credits for or is it just an extracurricular, like, for fun? Uh, no, this is just an extracurricular for fun. Um, in your senior year, there's actually a class called your Capstone Project, which is a uh, it's a senior design class where you um, get together in groups and you uh, pair up with a corporate sponsor and then you go ahead and you design something and actually build it and test it. And in the past, there's been a few Capstone Projects that have actually um, been streamlined through Formula SAE. So one year was... One year, a capstone project was sponsored by uh, Pratt and Miller, mm -hmm. and they helped us design some carbon suspension members to help reduce the overall weight of the vehicle. Um, then last year, there was a group of seniors who actually designed a rear wheel suspension, uh, rear wheel rear wheel steering suspension system. So, so this gives you a lot of practical experience, even if you don't want to uh, get in the auto industry or, or racing, you still could learn a lot about engineering and tech. Yeah. being involved. Yeah, so myself as a chess lead, I ended up at SpaceX this past semester working on primary structures. Uh, we actually have guys who uh, at you know, General Motors, um, Toyota, Ford, so it's definitely auto industry heavy, but um, it opens the door for a lot of different companies. And uh, who gets to uh, actually drive in the races? Uh, so uh, whoever's fastest gets to drive. It's like a trade-off between your overall driving skill and your weight, the main skill. Um, but every year, after the competition season's over, the entire team gets to drive the car once, uh, just as you know, a last two year off of the car and, a, and a, a nice reward for all the hard work. And are races throughout the year, or is there like a season? Uh, our first race is in May at Michigan International Speedway. Uh, and then the second race is in June and at uh, Lincoln, Nebraska, and then. There's certain races throughout there that are less prestigious than the, than the official FSA competitions, but um, normally the final race for our team is the Toronto Shootout okay. in Ontario. Well, good luck in all those races, and hey, keep thanks. up the good work. Yeah, appreciate it.